Hello, everybody. Welcome to Tanya's Tea Time. I'm Tanya. Thank you so much for being here with me and spending some time with me today. We are going to do a reading for the second week of November for Pisces 2021. And I hope everybody's having a great Scorpio season. It seems to be treating everybody pretty good. Pretty good, pretty good. Pisces, this is beautiful. We have uh, the Ace of Cups. This is the universe handing you a gift of love, asking you to be this vessel of love to somebody or presenting you with a gift of love, unconditional love, asking you, will you accept it? Knight of Pentacles, this is a stable offer coming in, some sort of offer of stability. This might be taking a journey, planning, um, moving in a positive direction. I always see this as like a world, like a globe, like he's just planning this trip. He, and he always looks like he's in an exotic land. You know, you always see like these mountains in the background and you're just like, where is he? Standing on a balcony somewhere, looking out into the distance, kind of dreaming. Pisces, you're a little, you, you dream a little too. So I think that's, I definitely can see that as a Pisces. <laughs> Strategically dreaming because a lot of times Pisces can dream and it's dream, dreaming to bring about something and actually planning here and actually making that manifest forward. And you might be dreaming about some sort of exciting love situation. You might be wanting to give somebody a stable, loving offer, Pisces, at this time. And it looks like you're doing very well. You are stable. You are enjoying your food, your drink, your life at this time. You, you are, you are abundant, Pisces, in this time. Doesn't mean that you're rich. Doesn't mean like you're gonna come across the, you know, a lotto win or anything. It just means that you're comfortable. It means that you're happy. It means that you have abundance. You have more than enough of what you need at this time the second week of November. And again, this is planning um, some sort of journey, some sort of new path, um, ready to take it. Like you haven't actually taken it. And this guy here, he's on the balcony, kind of looking out. He hasn't really ventured off yet. And this guy hasn't ventured off yet. He's, he's very grounded. He's grounding his energy. He's looking out. He's thinking and he's planning and there's the lovers Pisces I think you're planning on giving somebody an amazing offer or you've already made this offer and you're planning to go forward moving forward planning so that way you can give this offer stability so even if you're with somebody at this time, Pisces, you are, and you've already made this offer of love to somebody, you are stabilizing it. You are making sure that it's going nowhere. <laughs> this is a very serious commitment. Let's clarify a little bit. This is beautiful. Uh, let's start off with the this Knight of Pentacles, please. For Pisces. This is juggling or juggling roles and responsibilities. You might be juggling at this time, trying to um, make this offer. And it's with this card. It's with the, the four of pentacles. This could be like holding on um, to some sort of offer. But I this could also indicate you need to save. And in this time, you in this pentacles, 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 you might be saving your coin. You actually might be saving to present this offer to your lover, your your other soulmate, your your other half, because you're stable at this time. 
This is beautiful. What is this page of wands, please? This planning of yours, Pisces. I love a Pisces. My partner's a Pisces, too. The high priestess. <laughs> if you were looking for a confirmation, there you go. Pisces, this is um, you knowing. This is a um, divine connection uh, that the high priestess has, and she has a lot of intuition. She knows when it's time to do something. She knows sometimes before something even happens, it's going to happen. She knows when she puts a plan in motion, it's going to end up with success. It's going to work. It's going to come to some sort of fulfillment, Pisces. And I see you as this high priestess. You are planning. You are putting in the motion your plans. You are, you've done the, the dreaming, the thinking, the, the meditation, and you are definitely with your stability, moving on with your plans because you know they're going to be met with success with this loving situation. This is all about love, Pisces. What's on the bottom of your deck? Having to make a difficult decision about something, moving towards something with passion and there's stability. Moving forward with the chariot. Moving forward with stability and passion having to make this decision. Maybe this was you, you were sitting on the fence for a moment. This is you coming off the fence for sure because we have a chariot here. You are moving forward, Pisces, for sure. So Pisces, I don't feel like I have to clarify any further. It's a beautiful reading. Congratulations. And um, I hope to see you guys again. If you guys enjoy tarot, which I hope you do, and you enjoy oracle readings, and you occasionally enjoy, enjoy artwork because I do share some of my artwork occasionally. I'd love to have you guys back. Please subscribe, hit the like button, and I will see you guys again on the next one. Bye.